you ready to be my assistant? Yes. All right, let's go wrangle some cleavage. Yes. <laughs> Yes. You in? I have a good eye. Yeah. <laughs> I have an eye for these things. Are we ready for the reveal? Yes, I'm ready. Drop it. Uh, Woo! Yes. Yes, it's nice great. Part. I love it. Yeah, this oh, is my cool. first swimsuit. Where's your swimsuit? Uh, it's virtual. It's it's in my mind. <laughs> and there's this one really cool store I want to take you to. Uh -huh. The record store. The record store. It's really dope. This is it. Look, you want to see how long Fat Joe's been making music for? This is from 96. Wow. What does weapons mean? What it's, these, uh, these are basically like um, records that are really tools for scratching. Like, I don't know if there's for you an album that, that kind of changed your direction. You know, like maybe you listened to like hip hop when you were younger, but then yeah, like, what did you switch totally. from after that? Like, Radiohead and sure. Coldplay and all those sorts of bands that I got into and even like the Black Keys I yeah. discovered and yeah. like they, you know, the Black Keys changed my life definitely. I mean we all know what it's like to just be on the road all the time and you know I'm sure you must have your iPod with you and there's got to be some music that kind of like makes you feel just a certain comfort or brings yeah, you back totally. to home. Like, what's... Well I love Lauren Hill, yeah. I just love her emotion and I think she's really cool so I listen to a lot of her. <laughs> So what have you got coming up that's exciting? There's a bunch of records that are going to come out soon. Um, I work with this group, Duck Sauce. Mm -hmm. uh, so our album's about to come out, which is exciting to me because it's yeah. pretty much my first album. And then my label, Fool's Gold, we have some, some albums that are coming out. Uh, Danny Brown is a rapper on the label. His album's about to drop and Party Supplies mm -hmm. and a bunch of other guys on Fool's Gold. So getting these records ready to come out and then just like, I'm always touring. So yeah. more shows, more traveling. I really want to learn how to DJ. Yeah. So what are some, what's some tips, advice? I really want you to show me how to scratch, mix right. and... You're creating a sound on the turntable, but then the mixer can cut it on and off. Okay. And it's all a coordination between the two hands. That's the cool. tough part is coordinating yeah. the hand on the crossfader on the mixer, and the other hand on the record. Cool. Try that. Woo! Such an art form, like... I used to lock myself up, exactly. Yeah. Like, every day after school, when I was like 13, come straight home and practice till it was dinner time. Okay. I think you have a lot of potential to be world champion. Okay. I'm seeing it. Yeah. You're gonna be there with the belt. Okay, okay. Yeah, we'll